The 10 Most Famous Lions in History Discover the 10 most emblematic lions in history in our upcoming video. From Kamanyak and her maternal instinct to the legendary MGM lion Leo, we will explore the incredible stories of these majestic felines. From mythological heroes like the Nemean lion to conservation symbols like Cecil, get ready for a journey through the bravery, tragedy, and legacy of the most famous lions who have left their roar in the world. Number 10. The Lioness Kamunyak. The story of Kamunyak, an extraordinary lioness, is one of those tales that seem more like a fable than real life. Kamunyak, whose name means, the lucky one, in Ma, the language of the Maasai, became famous in the early 2000s for unusual and touching behavior that defied human understanding of the wild. Kamunyak lived in the Samburu Game Reserve in Kenya and stood out for adopting at least six oryx calves, a species of antelope, on different occasions. This behavior is extraordinary and almost unprecedented, as lions are known to be predators of oryx, not their protectors. The lioness not only allowed the oryx calves to stay by her side but also cared for and defended them against other predators, including other lions. The first adoption occurred in 2002, capturing the attention of scientists, conservationists, and the general public. Experts were puzzled by this behavior as it contradicted the basic understanding of predator-prey relationships. Some theories suggest that Kamanyak might have experienced a powerful maternal instinct after losing her own cub, which could explain her impulse to adopt the oryx calves. However, this behavior remains a mystery and a subject of fascination. Number 9. The Lion Sylvester. The Lion Sylvester is a fascinating character in the animal kingdom, known for his extraordinary tale of survival and adventure. He is not just any lion. Sylvester became a symbol of resilience and cunning, capturing the imagination of those who hear his story. This story begins in the Kegalagadi Transfrontier National Park, located in southern Africa, where Sylvester was born and originally lived. What sets Sylvester apart from other lions is his remarkable escape from the park in 2015. At a young age, Sylvester managed to break free, triggering an intense search that lasted several days. During his adventure, he covered vast distances, demonstrating an incredible ability to survive alone in the wild and vast African landscape. Sylvester's search involved not only park rangers but also captured the attention of the public, who followed eagerly every update on his whereabouts. Eventually, after several days of searching, Sylvester was found and returned to the park. However, what truly makes his story unique is the solution implemented to prevent future escapes. The decision was made to relocate him to a safer area within another reserve, where he could be closely monitored and live in a controlled yet still extensive environment suitable for his needs. Sylvester's story is a testament to the complexity of animal behavior and the intelligence of lions in particular. His ability to navigate and survive in the African environment evading his human pursuers for so long, highlights the cunning and resilience of these magnificent felines. Furthermore, it reflects the challenges faced by conservationists in trying to protect wild species while ensuring they can safely coexist near human communities. Number 8. The Lion Zamba. The Lion Zamba is one of the most iconic animals in the entertainment industry, especially remembered for his presence in numerous classic films. This majestic animal not only captivated audiences of all ages with his imposing presence but also became a lasting symbol of strength and courage. Zamba was more than just a lion. He was a versatile actor who displayed a wide range of emotions on screen, from ferocity to tenderness, curiosity, and loyalty. His ability to interact safely with human actors set him apart from other animals in film and contributed to his legendary status. Zamba's story is also a testament to the special bond that can exist between humans and wild animals. Throughout his career, Zamba worked closely with trainers who understood his needs and behaviors, allowing for safe filming for both the animal and the production crew. 
Zamba's legacy lives not only through the films in which he appeared but also in how he changed public perception of lions. Instead of seeing them solely as fearsome beasts, Zamba helped showcase the emotional and social complexity of these magnificent animals. His impact transcends entertainment. Zamba became an ambassador for his species, inspiring generations of viewers to learn more about lion conservation and their natural habitats. Number 7. The Lions of Savo. The Lions of Savo are a fascinating chapter in zoological history, standing out as an intriguing trivia fact about lions in general. These are not just ordinary lions. They are known for their unique behavior and for playing a notorious role in Kenya's history during the construction of the Uganda Railway in the late 19th century. The story begins in 1898 when the bridge over the Savo River was being built as part of the railway that would connect Uganda to the port of Mombasa on the east coast of Africa. During this project, two male lions, notably without manes, began preying on the construction workers, creating an atmosphere of terror and mystery among the laborers. The attacks continued for several months, with estimates varying widely regarding the number of victims, although it is frequently mentioned that the lions killed more than 35 workers. The chief engineer of the project, Lieutenant Colonel John Henry Patterson, was forced to take action. After several failed attempts, Patterson managed to hunt down both lions, putting an end to the attacks. The bodies of these lions are now at the Field Museum of Natural History in Chicago, where they have been extensively studied. The lions of Savo are particularly notable for several reasons. First, they deviated from the typical behavior of lions, who rarely see humans as prey. Second, the lack of mane on these male lions is a distinctive feature of some lions in the Savo region, which has been the subject of scientific study. It has been suggested that this feature may be related to the extremely hot climate of the region, although theories vary. Number 6. The Lion Scarface. The Lion Scarface, one of the most emblematic and recognized felines in the vast and wild expanse of the African savanna, is not just a fictional character from a famous animated film but was a true monarch of nature. This lion, nicknamed for the distinctive scar across his face, became a living legend in the Serengeti National Park in Tanzania. Scarface and his three brothers, collectively known as the Four Musketeers, dominated the region with an unmatched blend of strength, cunning, and cooperation. Born around 2008, Scarface quickly distinguished himself not only for his leadership skills but also for his notable scar, which he acquired in 2012 during a confrontation with other lions over territory and power. This mark not only gave him a fierce appearance but also symbolized his resilience and ability to survive in a relentless environment. Under his leadership, the Four Musketeers maintained control over the largest lion prides in the Serengeti, ensuring access to the best hunting areas and protecting their members from external threats. Scarface, in particular, earned the respect of both his fellow lions and the humans fortunate enough to observe him becoming an icon of the struggle for survival in the wild. Despite adversities, including battles for territory, diseases, and constant competition for food, Scarface managed to survive to an advanced age for a wild lion. His presence in the Serengeti was a powerful reminder of the majesty of wild nature and the importance of conserving these unique ecosystems for future generations. Number 5. The Nemean Lion. The Nemean Lion is a fascinating mythological figure found in Greek mythology, representing not only strength and power but also heroic challenges and cunning to overcome seemingly insurmountable obstacles. According to legend, this lion was a fearsome beast residing in Nemea, a region of ancient Greece, and was known for its impenetrable skin, which was resistant to mortal weapons, making it invulnerable to any attack. This lion was not merely an animal but a monster sent by Hera, the wife of Zeus, to terrorize the region. The story of the Nemean lion is best known for its role in the Twelve Labors of Hercules, Heracles in Greek, 
the mythological hero destined to serve King Eurystheus and complete a series of seemingly impossible tasks as penance for his sins. Hercules's first task was to kill the Nemean lion. Upon arriving in Nemea, Hercules quickly discovered that his arrows were useless against the beast, forcing him to rethink his strategy. Demonstrating both his ingenuity and superhuman strength, Hercules chose to confront the lion in hand-to-hand -hand combat inside its own lair. After a fierce battle, Hercules managed to strangle the lion, using his own brute strength to overcome the beast. Then, with cunning equal to his valor, Hercules skinned the lion using one of the animal's own claws, thus overcoming the invulnerability of its skin. Number 4. The Lioness Elsa The story of the Lioness Elsa is one of the most touching and fascinating tales of interaction between humans and wild animals, capturing the imagination of people worldwide. This narrative focuses on Elsa, a lioness raised by George and Joy Adamson in Kenya during the 1950s, after being orphaned when George Adamson, then a game warden, was forced to kill her mother during a hunting incident. Unlike other lions raised by humans, Elsa was not destined for a life in captivity or a zoo. The Adamsons made the pioneering decision to attempt to reintegrate her into the wild, a process that had never before been documented or attempted with a lion under similar conditions. Elsa's story became world famous thanks to the 1960 book, Born Free, written by Joy Adamson, and subsequently by the film and theme song that followed. The process of reintegrating Elsa into her natural habitat was long and arduous, filled with challenges for both Elsa and the Adamsons. They had to teach her how to hunt, how to interact with other lions, and how to find water, skills she would have learned from her mother under normal circumstances. What made Elsa's story unique was not only the fact that she was successfully reintegrated into the wild but also the deep emotional connection she maintained with the Adamsons, occasionally returning to visit them. Elsa's story challenged conventional perceptions of the time about the relationship between humans and wild animals, demonstrating that a much deeper coexistence and mutual understanding were possible than had previously been considered. The lioness Elsa became a symbol of conservation efforts and the potential of wildlife to adapt and thrive, even after human intervention. Sadness came with Elsa's premature death in 1961, due to a blood disease. However, her legacy endures to this day, inspiring conservation efforts and a deep respect for wildlife worldwide. Number 3. The Lion Christian. The case of the Lion Christian is a fascinating example of the complex relationship that can exist between humans and wild animals, demonstrating a deep emotional connection that defies usual expectations. Christian was a lion acquired in 1969 by two friends, John Rendell and Anthony Ace Burke, from a department of Harrods store in London, which at that time sold a variety of exotic animals. Rendell and Burke, struck by the idea that such a majestic being could be confined in such a limited and unsuitable space for its natural needs, decided to buy him and raise him in their London apartment. As Christian grew, it became evident that he could not remain in an urban environment. His story took a notable turn when the two friends contacted George Adamson, a conservationist renowned for his work reintegrating lions into the wild. Adamson accepted the challenge of helping Christian adapt to his natural habitat in Kenya. Christian's reintroduction to the wild was a success, adapting well and eventually leading his own pride. However, what truly captured the public's imagination and heart was the emotional reunion between Christian and his former caregivers, Rendell and Burke, one year after his release. Contrary to all expectations, Christian recognized his human friends, demonstrating affection and joy in an encounter that was recorded and went viral years later on the internet. Number 2. The Lion Cecil. The Lion Cecil was an iconic African lion who lived in Hawene National Park in Zimbabwe. Born around 2002, Cecil became a local celebrity and a conservation symbol thanks to his imposing presence and majestic black mane. 
He was part of a long-term study by the University of Oxford, which tracked his movements using a GPS tracking collar. This allowed researchers to gather valuable data on movement patterns, behavior, and social dynamics of lions in the region. Cecil's story took a tragic turn in July 2015 when he was illegally hunted by an American dentist during a bow hunting expedition on the outskirts of the park. Cecil's death sparked global outrage, triggering a global debate on trophy hunting and wildlife conservation. Many saw his death not only as a tragic loss of a unique animal life but also as a symbol of broader challenges facing wildlife conservation in Africa and worldwide. Cecil's case highlighted the need for stricter policies regarding trophy hunting and strengthening conservation measures. In response to his death, there was an increase in support for lion and other wildlife conservation, with calls for changes in legislation both locally in Zimbabwe and internationally. Cecil's story serves as a powerful reminder of the connection between humans and wildlife and the shared responsibility to protect these magnificent creatures for future generations. Number 1. The Lion Leo of Metro-Goldwyn-Mayer The Lion Leo of Metro-Goldwyn-Mayer MGM, is one of the most recognized and iconic logos in cinema history. Since its first appearance in 1916, this iconic symbol has roared at the beginning of countless films, ingraining itself in the collective memory of audiences worldwide. The image of the head of a majestic lion, encased in a golden circle of filmmaking, with the inscription, Ars Gratia Artis, Art for Art's Sake, is a distinctive hallmark of MGM. Over the years, several lions have filled the role of Leo, but it is the current Leo that has garnered the most recognition, becoming synonymous with cinematic quality and top-tier entertainment. What few know is that behind this image are fascinating stories of how these segments were filmed, with technical and logistical challenges overcome to capture the perfect roar. Leo the Lion not only symbolizes the strength and majesty of the King of the Jungle but also represents innovation and tradition in the film industry. MGM has managed to keep this symbol alive over the years, adapting it to the times without losing its essence. This lion is not just a logo, it is a living testimony to the history of cinema, a reminder of Hollywood's classic roots and its evolution into the future. Leo's cultural impact goes beyond cinema. It has become a popular icon, appearing on merchandise, parodies, and tributes, demonstrating its enduring presence in the collective imagination. The image of Leo Roaring is not just the announcement of an MGM movie, it is a symbol of the magic of cinema, inviting viewers to an immersive experience in stories that excite, entertain, and enrich.